I try not to read the synopsis, but I was curious as I was sitting here, and then suddenly I just see in the description, warning for green. I don't know what that means. I feel out of the loop, but maybe we'll understand when we watch the episode. <laughs> Hello everyone, my name is Zammer. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video and the second to watch with me. It has been four months since we've had our last episode of Hell of a Boss, so I'm very excited to see what the team has for us. Uh, again, big shout out to Fizzy Pop. Please go over to the official uh, YouTube channel and click the episode over there. Watch it over there as well because they deserve all the love and support. So without further ado, let's get started. Okay. Oh, the mug's so cute. Wow. I checked it's up yourself. Pay. And it said I lost two pounds this week. <laughs> Congrats, that's great. Sweetie, what's wrong? Millie, honey, everything okay? <laughs> Yeah. Oh, just bumped into an ex. Oh. Oh. He just kept going on about how he has money now and a bright future and a bigger cock. Wait, what? Every uh. time I see his stupid face, I can't help it. I just need to. Okay, sweetheart. We got some feelings that we should talk about. What is this? Uh, research for science. Put it back correctly, okay? I alphabetized them. Okay, so let oh? me get this straight. You don't want us going to Earth at all for this job. Correct. That will not be necessary. I'd like to meet you and your whole crew at my estate. Uh, you want us killing someone in hell? Because I gotta tell you, that ain't exactly our business no more. I'll tell you all about it when you're here. It's in regards to a business venture I'm sure will be very worth your time. Oh. Ooh, how ominous. That is very <laughs> ominous. Fine, whatever. What's the address? I don't trust this. Has already been taken care of. I really don't trust this. I would say let's not go. I don't think this is worth. Is Satan's ass crack. I'm Luna, could you like, I don't know, ass. react a little bit? Slightly alarming. My research. <laughs> As you should throw up. Right this way, please. Uh, sir, what's going on? <laughs> now don't worry, it's just some fancy schmuck from greed wanting to do business with us. Okay. Uh, sir, I don't think this is a good idea. It'll be fine. Now get your asses moving. I really don't think it's a good idea, but... Is this thing safe? Don't worry, we are professionals! Oh! Okay. So, greed! I'm starting to recognize the warning for green! It, Ugh, it all uh, place makes oh, sense. Oh, yeah. This is your old stomping ground, isn't it, Mox? Yeah, unfortunately. Oh, no. I grew up just over there. Swore I'd never come this, back. And, uh... This, uh, yeah. What, what, where, where are we going? Oh, what, no. Let's... Who did you say this meeting was with? I'm not sure. Just some rich somebody or other who wants to discuss biz at his place. No, no. Are we going to your parents? Oh, no. No, oh, no, Moxie, no, 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 I'm so no, no, sorry. No, 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 no. Has Millie there met his family? Is, is my boy. Get over here and give your daddy a hug. Daddy. Oh. I only let Moxie call me that. Oh. Unless you pay me. <laughs> Guys. Um, oh. This is my father, Crimson. Sir, this is my boss, Blitz. And my... Millie, I'm his wife. And oh. what a beautiful wife you are. Oh, Max, where well, you been hiding this pretty little thing? Oh, no. Oh, I'm sure he would have introduced us eventually. Oh, I'm sure. You I don't like this. With the Ooh, silent... He gives oh, me the heebie-jeebies. Right? I've heard a lot of good things about you and your work. Really? What kind of shit has Moxie been spreading what? about me? I'll fucking kill you, Moxie. Oh don't you fucking test me. No, no. Oh. 
from all over. Looks like you're building a bit of a name for yourself here, kid. Really? <laughs> well, I guess it's about time folks recognize my talent. Okay. I like your attitude. Well, I hope you're all hungry. We put together a fabulous dinner for you. Mm. Hey, baby. Why haven't I met your pa before? Well, uh, you know, it, it's, it's, it's just never been a... Hey, you two. Move it before it gets cold. Look, look, Millie, we can talk about it later. I mean, he literally said in the helicopter that he never wanted to come back here. So I think you can probably put some assumptions together pretty quickly. Just gonna say. What are we doing here, sir? Moxie, I raised you better than that. You know there's no business before dinner. Besides, we're still waiting on one more. What is up, party people? Oh no, what? is this your you ex? Know him? You remember that ex I was talking about? Oh, Looks no! like I have two big sex reunions today. How lucky am I? Did you date him too? <laughs> yeah, no big deal, but I've usually boned half the people in any room I'm in. Are you fucking kidding me? There's someone who's fucked both of you? It was oh. a long time ago. Wow, that's a, that's a plot like twist. Yesterday. You, a fledgling mafioso, me, the dashing and extremely sexy muscle. It was like it was written in the stars. Oh my god. Ah, Moxie in the mafia. Ooh, okay, I'm getting rich. some secondhand embarrassment here. Oh, is that mom? She's pretty. Oh shit. You've never told me this before. I I don't really like to talk about this part of my life, but I first saw Chaz at my induction into the family. Oh boy. Our eyes met. Oh my gosh, stop. Room, and there was just something about him. Ah! Something that was magnetic. Okay. Oh my gosh, stop. Uh. that boat movie did any of that stuff yeah that escalated happen? oh yeah <laughs> but he skipped over the jizz covered parts anyway things changed when we went on a heist together i'm good i'm good i'm good cool Oh. Okay, not much of a talker, are we? Ugh, I'm Blitz, the O is silent. Now, I'm sure we're gonna get along just fine. So what you deal, what you do, who'd you diddle? You look like someone who's good with a gun. You look like someone who'd shoot up an office, and I hope you are. So I got a plan to get us out of this dump, but I'm gonna need some help. You think you can give me a hand? I need to get out to my can you let him the babysitter will talk kill me at all? Once I got out, I never looked back. Hmm. Well, like you said, Millie should be upset. Honestly, doubly <laughs> upset by her own heartbreak from him and her husband's heartbreak from him. Get him, girl. Girl, get him. Get him. You should have died, bitch. Dinner is served. Oh. <laughs> Look at her glare. I love it. Female rage at its finest. I suppose you want to know why you're here. Yeah, so what gives? I mean, you know, we kill people on Earth, right? We don't normally do contracts for locals. So if you want to do business with us, you got to. I don't want to do business with IMP. Oh, I want to do business with Moxie. Me? Oh. Yeah, kid. I summoned IMP to be sure you'd show. Oh. Because, well, we're bringing Chaz into the family. What? Oh. Since when can just anyone join the family? Come on, Mox. You had responsibilities here that I had to pick up once you left. Oh. Now Chaz is going to lighten the load. Wait. Oh! I thought you always hated his guts. Well, 
I don't know if I exactly hated him. You called him a friendless horse fucker and said we lived a sissy lifestyle. Yeah, well, I was wrong. <laughs> You've been gone a long time, Mox. A man can change. And so is Chaz. Yeah, I've grown. Mature. I love the music and change every time. Came into millions. But, you know, mostly the mature thing. Oh, okay, okay. So the horseless friend fucker over here gets a little moolah, and suddenly it's worth wasting our time over? Well, I'm the whole package, if you know what I mean. I got a big dick. No, no, I don't... I didn't need to... I, I understood. Oxy here is going to officially release his holdings in the organization. Then you can get back to ignoring your family to your heart's content. Maybe oh. he wouldn't ignore his family if they didn't force him to rub elbows with a no good shark tooth fuck face. Yay, look, everybody. Can I know ass. their background, I know please? Tensions have been high tonight. Say, why don't you stay here and get some rest? No. We'll have the ceremony tomorrow, and then you will be free to leave. I have your rooms all prepared. Yes, sir. Ma? Oh. A moment, Moxie. Oh no. Just give me a minute, Millie. Oh, I'll boy. be there. I don't like this. <laughs> don't touch her. So, you think you're too good for this family now? What? Come here. I, I don't understand. <laughs> you think you're gonna just get to walk away from this family and never come back? Get that wrong, Mox. Matter of fact, the only thing you're right about is that that obnoxious piss stain can't get made. Not unless he marries in. Oh. Marries? But, but who would he? Who do you think? This family oh. needs that money. And it's about time your pathetic ass was useful for no. something. Sir, I'm already married. I, I can't. You think I give a shit about your stupid beard? Come on, Mox. I even went through the trouble of making the house more to your kind's liking. Oh no. Oh! 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 My! Wait, gosh! What, what do you think I'm into? What? This is the kind of shit gays like, right? Okay, first off, Dad, I'm bisexual. Yeah, gay. Oh, for oh my sake. god! Secondly, I don't know a single person of any sexuality who'd enjoy this. <laughs> There's dicks in the walls. Oh, that's <laughs> fucking hilarious. <laughs> Look at Not One helping! Way or another, you're gonna do what I fucking say. Don't cross me. Aww. Oh. Ooh, okay. I was wondering about mom. Oh. Oh. Wow. when you cross me. Oh. Oh, no. Now get to bed, Moxie. You have a big day tomorrow. <sighs> yes, sir. Oh, okay. and Mox, if you ever talk back to me again, you and that pretty little thing you brought here are going home in boxes. Capiche? Yes, sir. All right. The... <sighs> Can we just have a serious Wait, moment without the? How come we aren't? A... Crimson wants you all to stay in separate you rooms. You know why, Moxie? 
It's just one night, Millie. It's okay. Max, are you okay? I'm fine. Mm. Please don't worry, sweetie. You know you can tell me anything. Mm. Right? Yes. Everything's fine. Your partner's Max. It's just my dad. It's okay, really. It'll be over tomorrow. Okay. I love you. I love you too. Aww. Good night. My heart is breaking right now. Please don't what be the in here. Fucking why? Ah! Serious. Oh my gosh. I'm not acknowledging the sign back there. I'm not. Nope. Nope. Not. Not doing like that. What I've done with the place. Of course. Ugh. Oh my god, the sign! Get out of here. Come on, Mark. We used to have so much fun here, remember? I married Chaz. No. And even if I weren't, I would never. Never what? Let me take you to come town again. Oh my you God. are so gross. Just leave me alone. I know what you want most, Moxie Popsy. How about a sexually charged musical number? Hey. Oh. You always love those. Oh. You wondering when I'm gonna crack you open like a walnut? And the answer is soon. <sighs> <laughs> I'm feeling, feeling and I'm feeling that you wanna feel my feelings and feel the feel you feel me? Sex of fall here. I don't so actually feel you. You just tell me when this is over. I don't want to see this. <laughs> Why are there gallons of lube? <sighs> oh, I'm so sorry. If he comes to Mama? your room. What do you want? <laughs> I'll just continue the song. Damn Thank it. you, girl. This usually works. Oh. Hey there, good looking. Oh, I was wondering how long it would take for you to make a pass. Mm. Ah! Does that mean you're down to clown? Ew, what? You think I would violate my friend's trust by sleeping with their ex, especially one who fucked them over yes, the way you, you did? I'll show you all the things they liked in the sack. Deal. God damn it. Let's. <laughs> oh, no! Some like earplugs. No. Oh. These pictures are so cute. Oh. Oh. I'm gonna ignore that whisper. That bed in bed can score two hotties that easily. I know you've got to be hiding something. with Eminem's marriage, but me. No. Oh. Uh, Sorry, oh. babe. You aren't the only junk in my trunk. <laughs> Damn it. That is not a good one. Honestly, I thought that was the best one. <laughs> hey, hey, the man of the hour. You ready to get started? Wait, where's Blitz? I think I saw him head outside. He said something about needing some fresh air or something. Why don't you grab him so we can get moving? Be right back. Baby. Oh no. What you looking so glum for, kid? It's your wedding day. Best uh... day of your life. <laughs> I'm not doing it. What was that? Yes! I couldn't make it out over the sound of you being a whiny bitch. I said I'm not doing it, sir. 
I've spent my whole life being afraid of you, but I'm not giving up the only good thing I've ever had just so you can keep your fragile little sense of control over everything. Millie is a good woman, a better woman than I deserve. And there's nothing that scares me more than hurting her. Not even you. I'm leaving, Dad. And if you or Herpes the Clown over here hey. try mm -hmm. to stop me, you'll learn firsthand just how good I've gotten. Oh, that job. shot was so good. <sighs> Now take care of the others. No. Uh oh. Uh oh. Oh, Millie. You found me. <gasps> Who's your friend? Friend? Oh. Oh, thank you. Oh. Yes, girl. Oh, okay. That was a lot, though. Okay. Okay. Come get yeah, yeah, yeah. your Don't man, worry, girl. Man. Let's get this thing rolling, eh? Oh. You told me all the chairs would be filled. Uh. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, oh. Satisfied? Oh, fuck yes. What is going on? That seductive dick hole is trying to marry Moxie, and he's not even rich. Moxie! Oh! Cheswick Terminal. Take Do we... Moxie in the last name. It's funny. It's a good joke. It's a great joke. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna need you to stop. Take Cheswick Terman to be your lawfully wedded. Look at that. He's just so fucking happy to be here. Everything's locked down. How are we gonna get in? Oh. Probably no. no. Chaz isn't even rich. Okay, check his car. He just played you like a fucking rube. <laughs> Later, losers. Damn. Oh. <laughs> <Aww>. <laughs> well, this has been an inve Luna, did you never even move? Millie, thank you for saving me. You're amazing. Next time, just tell me if your dad is a psychopath. I can handle it. Well, yes, I'm girl. Glad everything ended up okay. Good to know we both have daddy issues, Mox. Also, I got to plow your ex-boyfriend. Isn't that great? Now we all awesome. fuck the same guy. Great. No, that's awesome. Love that. Oh no. Woo! Good. Okay, well, a moment of silence for Chaz. We had him all of one episode and he is now dead. Um, so R.I.P. Chaz. Um, damn. That was pretty brutal, I'll be honest. I uh 
especially after we had the previous episode, episode two with Octavia and Luna, those very beautiful, touching, heartfelt moments, father-daughter relationships coming in, to then this episode, X's and O's, which was like the exact opposite. I mean, father-child relationships still, but maybe a less good one. <laughs> But wow, um, first off, um, again, amazing shots in here. Everything is always so beautiful, so polished. They put so much time and love into these episodes, and I'm constantly impressed by the entire crew and the voice actors um, every step of the way. This uh, whole episode and every episode is just gorgeous. Um, and then just the production level of having these beautifully maybe beautiful is not the correct word but these wonderfully crafted songs whether or not they are about questionable topics is you know another thing but they're always really well done and fit the scene and always provide this layer of um humor as well as adding more uh depth into a scene so i always love the music production um i thought this was interesting because we finally got to learn more about moxie and kind of his backstory uh those daddy issues and getting more of um an understanding of moxie and millie's relationship and their past kind of coming together and rearing his head uh chaz was an interesting character I like that he's just kind of a bumbling buffoon. And I really do appreciate in the storytelling that we get Millie's anger first. And just all these like little jokes before we meet Chaz. I felt like it was really well done with her being like, he says he's rich now. He says he's got a bigger, you know. <laughs> and so it's just funny when we meet him later and it's like, oh, it's you, the guy who has the bigger okay <laughs> it's very humorous and i really do love this show i feel like they have truly like crafted their formula for what they want hello boss to be i feel like it's never pointlessly raunchy as some shows do tend to be where it's hard to find the humor where i feel like hell of a boss uh has really learned that and understood that well from its pilot episode to then episode one when they crafted it and really refined it in that, you know, like the, the, um, so uncomfortable saying this, uh, when we had the colorful arrays of pleasurous toys, that's what we'll call them. <laughs> um, the joke, there was a joke there. It wasn't just, you know, goofy randomness. Like, ha, huh, this is funny. It's like, uh, his dad was like, oh, you gays like this. Here you go. And it's like, I'm bisexual. And he's like, yeah, gay. <laughs> like, it's funny because it is just this absurdity, especially to people who probably like this show. It is an absurdity. To some people, maybe not such an absurdity because they are not as uh, LGBTQ friendly. So, you know, to each their own. <laughs> but I thought this one had so perfectly timed humor from like Chaz going to Moxie first, then to try with Millie, and then just being like Blitz. And Blitz is like, yeah, DTF. Let's go. <laughs> like, it's just like, oh, dude. Granted, he did find out information for us, which was helpful. But it is awkward because now it's like, look, we've all fucked the same person. Isn't that great? And it's like, yeah, so good. Love that. Love that. <laughs> so very humorous. I am a bit nervous about dad coming back. I feel like. The members of Imp make a lot of enemies and I'm nervous because, you know, we always hint that there's still aggression and anger there and they're probably going to come back again. So it does make me incredibly nervous every time because I'm like, oh, no, 
when is when are they gonna come back and rear their ugly head and ruin everything for us <laughs> like it's this dread that sits over me <laughs> but honestly i think it's really good storytelling to have these characters and basically having these underlying problems that we will get back to eventually like stole us is another one and his ex-wife being around in present um it's all very interesting and we had the little uh cher cherubit cherubi cherubis oh, i'm probably pronouncing it wrong i'm so sorry but we have them still kind of lurking around not really uh happy with us so it's interesting and i think the uh show does a very good job of having these little nuggets around so it'll be interesting as we continue on to see kind of what the next episodes will unfold for us especially because stolas and uh blitz haven't really you know fixed things yet and we still kind of need to go over that and figure out what their relationship is going to be moving forward if there is any true relationship at all you know so we'll see what happens. I'm still very curious because I feel like we kind of left off on that note and haven't really mended that yet. Whether we will mend it or not, who knows? But nevertheless, I had a great time watching this. I hope you guys did as well. Uh, thank you for being patient while um, I got around to actually watching it. <laughs> I really do appreciate it. So thank you guys so much. Please remember to support the official release of the episode over on Vimsy Pop's channel. And if you like my content and want to make sure you get up to date when I post, you can hit that subscribe button. You can hit it with your elbow if you want to. That sounds great. <laughs> but thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you all later.